Okay, today we're going to convert this remote control car into a moving camera mount that you can have a lot of fun with and do all kinds of crazy stuff with without worrying about getting yourself hurt. So you're going to need yourself a good remote control car, um, a camera, you're going to need your flashlight for night shots. Uh, this is actually going to be used to uh, mount your flashlight later. Uh, I've already taken the liberty to tear apart a, um, a tripod and uh, get you the mounting piece. Um, you're going to need some screws and washers, um, a piece of metal to mount everything to, and a couple of screwdriver bits. Um, now, I've already removed the screws from uh, the remote control car. Once you pull it out, you're going to unplug the lights, you're going to unplug the antenna, and you're going to put the top to the side. Um, what I would like to do is I like to uh, fish our antenna out of the way um, so that it still is um, extended as much as possible and um, doesn't get interfere with the sh line of sight on your camera. Alright, then what we're going to do is we're going to take this mount, we're going to take uh, a little piece of metal flashing, uh, line up the hole in the bottom, get yourself a uh, nice fat screw that's going to fit in there, uh, work on tightening that real good in there. Let's tighten this down. We can't have it loose at all, because if it is, you know, um, the camera will shake all over the place, and that's not what we want. And we're going to take ourselves a couple of washer and another bowl. And the uh, nice thing about this remote control car is um, I measured out the mounting brackets already. Um, pop this in, and you line up your screws here. Um, I actually have to change bits. Hold on one second. Make sure it's good and tight. And put in your other side of this. Missed the whole thing. Sorry about that, guys. And we're going to take it down real good. Alright, then what we're going to do is uh, simply take our, our sticky mount and pull this off. Pop it right here on in the front. Uh, that's going to be for the flashlight. Um, if you want to do some night shots, you just pop it in there. And the flashlight's ready to go just for those night shots pop the camera on top and then strap down everything else and you're good to go. Okay, so we got the camera set up and the car ready to go. What I'm going to do now is, because we're it's nighttime, I'm going to turn on the light right here. I'm going to flip my camera out of the way and I'm going to show you a little bit of driving.